Hey everyone, Dylan here, and uh, I know it's been a while, but um, honestly, the reason why I haven't uploaded in quite a while is because I kind of ran out of ideas, honestly. I kind of covered most things that I could think of, and of course, like, if I ever do have an idea like I, I do today, um, I will upload, but I, you know, uploads will be kind of not very frequent because I don't have a lot of ideas, like I said. And, um, so if you have any suggestions, anything you'd want to see or me to make a video on that I haven't already, or you have some questions that maybe I could answer in a video, let me know in the comments below. And, um, we can, you know, <laughs> you know, work, work through that. And, uh, so yeah, so that's why if you, like, that's why I haven't uploaded in a while. But anyways, today's video is about basically Android accessible games and what that is is I know like for blind people there's not a lot of games that you can play and do like uh, on Android but there's a lot of accessible games on Apple like that you can look up and it's easier to find it's way easier um, the majority of accessible games for blind people is on Apple and <clears throat> excuse me and the rest are and then there are some PC games and then uh, <laughs> there's like hardly no um, Android games there are some and today I'm gonna help you find them because no one covers them and uh, I'm not gonna say there's a lot um, by the way um, <clears throat> I um, got my first Apple device and I'll be getting it very soon and um, I have always had a uh, an Android smartphone so this will be the first time ever I try the accessibility on Apple so stay tuned for that I will be eventually making a video talking about you know Android's accessibility for blind people versus um, Apple's and their iOS and uh, what I think about it for the first time of me using it and always have using Android and then to go to that so it's, it'll be really interesting and I'll be able to give you my thoughts and opinions on it but that'll be in a in like a week or two so um but yeah anyways so I wanted to talk about how you can try to find uh <clears throat> some Android games you could go into the Google Play app store and you know type in blind games and you might find a couple things but uh here's a resource to help you find more than that and um so you're you would go to your whatever your browser of choice on your phone and to go to audiogames.net i'll try to leave a link in the description or whatever if i remember but um yeah it's audiogames.net it's spelled how you <clears throat> would think it's spelled and um that will give make pull you to a site that has a bunch of games that are audio games and accessible games that you can like look through but to find the Android games I'm gonna tell you how to do that so when you go to uh, audiogames.net and you go to their home page um, you're gonna go down a couple times until you you're gonna find two different search things the, um, the one the second one that you're gonna find that you're gonna listen for is um, browse uh, browse games and something like that and above that one is you know kind of like search database and you're gonna go to the search games database one uh, link and then when you go to that you're gonna go it'll take you to another page and on that web page you're going to <clears throat> you're gonna go down to the first like typing box and it's it, it's the keywords typing box and then you're gonna type in Android and then search and then once you've done that it'll bring up a list of 50 Android games that are for Android so no guesswork you know what they're for um, it is a little cumbersome because you have to um, you unfortunately every time you click on one they don't tell you what they're about you have to guess on the title so you gotta see a title that seems interesting to you go to it and then it'll have all the details where to download it information about the game and then, and then uh i wish it was just as simple as okay you you bookmark that one 
and you're going to come back to it. But if you try to go back to the previous page, it'll say you don't have the correct data or something or it's weird. So you're going to have to go back one more time back to the keyword box page and, you know, uh, just, you know, type that in and then uh, it should be saved. But like the Android should be in the thing in the bot list box still so you just click search again and then you go back to that list and it is a little cumbersome but this is what i found i've had to really dig to find uh blind accessible games for android so um that's kind of how you do it on audiogames.net i hopefully i explained everything good enough um there are an, in maybe another video i'll probably give a spotlight or a highlight to a game on android that I really, really liked. Um, but it would take too long in this video and I just want you to have the information in this video instead of <laughs> me jabbering about a game for too long. So yeah, but anyways, uh, that's about it for me. Like I said, uh, comment down below if you have any suggestions for other videos you want me to do or questions or anything like that. Um, but um, for now, that's been it for me. And uh, like I said, I'll be making a video on what my experience is with uh, iOS and Apple for the first time and then my you know opinions between it and Android and all that so that'll be coming and then, like I said another video is uh, a game an accessible game on Android I'm gonna highlight so yeah anyways uh, that's been it for me thank you guys for watching thank you guys for listening like the video subscribe comment all that good stuff and I will see you guys in the next video